What's going on everybody? It's the Crazy Asian back again with another watch unboxing and this time I think I've gone too far because I didn't buy this watch from an AD. I bought it from a secondary market dealer, which is against my morals because I I, I generally I actually like to pride myself on buying things at retail price and not paying more for something that's worth how much at retail. So I've gone a bit too far, but you know, I had to do it for the views. So give it a like. Uh, I make no money from this. So donate to me if you can. Now, the story behind this watch, I was walking around Georgia. I was just walking around Georgia, just scrolling through Facebook, checking, checking out stuff on Facebook. And then uh, I'm in some watch Facebook groups, right? And one of the watch Facebook groups, there was a watch for sale. And the, the headline was price below retail. And like price below retail, uh, what model is this one? I didn't actually consider this model before, but it is a sport model, sub, uh, it's a sport model Rolex. And now normally Rolex sport models are like double the retail, you know, like Daytona's are like all double and a half, Submariner's are double, GMT Masters are pretty much double. This one was not double. This one I looked at the retail price and it was only like 10% more. And I was like, 10% more? If it's only 10% more, it can't be that bad. Like, I mean, I'm, I'm actually willing to pay maybe 10% more just, I mean, if I can get a sport model, right? And so I messaged the guy, I didn't end up buying it from him. But then I kind of like kind of regret it because I didn't buy it. And then I also thought uh, ever since I bought the day date, I like that one so much. I don't really like my other watches as much. I, but I wouldn't wear that day date as like a, a daily even because it's not suitable for daily wear. So I, was, I have five watches as of right now. And I'm just thinking like that's just too many. You know, you don't really need five watches. Like it's just way too many. You don't want that many. And it's kind of annoying. You have to like screw them every single day to make sure they get the same date, they don't stop working. So I was a little bit annoyed. I decided to sell all my watches except for two, one for a daily and one for like special occasions. So this is the one I'm gonna keep for my daily and let's do the unboxing. I bought it, uh, it, was, it was lucky because it was located in Sydney so I didn't have to pay any tax for like import taxes or anything like that. Uh, the guy was really close and the guy, <laughs> it's a funny story, he looked like he was always on cocaine. He, he was like, he had a big white smile, I was like, hey man, and like shaking my hand and just like super excited. I thought he was on cocaine. It's like, kind of like, uh, look, I'm not on cocaine, okay? I don't do any drugs. I don't even drink alcohol. I know I'm excited because I just bought a watch. That's my cocaine. So let's do the unboxing. I got it on my piano. So this is... Oh man, I hope I don't like smash the watch off. I hope I don't smash the watch off my like piano. Okay, here we go. This is a smaller box. Okay, I'm gonna go through the front camera now. Fuck man, it's not opening. All right, hang on. This is the Rolex Yachtmaster Platinum Bezel Blue Dial. Yeah, it's very light, it's very light, and it's just a great daily wear. I, th I think it looks really cool in the blue dial, especially in the light. You see, it's like this kind of like metallic. Yeah, daily wear, it's my first sport model. And honestly, I'm not gonna get any more watches unless it's like an AP at retail or a paddock at retail. I'm not, this is it, this is it. I'm gonna sell all my other watches. It's just, I don't actually like collecting that. Like the tag coat, I'm never gonna wear it. The, the Tudor, I'm never gonna wear it. I'm gonna wear this one and the day date. The date, the date just of my first Swiss watch, great story, but I'm not gonna wear it anymore. So yeah, message me if you wanna buy some of my watches. Um, and then, yeah. So this is what it looks like on my wrist. Pretty cool. Now, I've got a treat for you. Y'all ready for this? I gotta play with my right hand. But my Rolex is on my left hand. Do, 
da 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 The Simpsons. Okay. Wee! Hey! 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 Hey!